waiting for oh so long, just waiting for Jay to come along to tell you when time we gonna get back to that love song. Yes, I know that's true. Uh, the rumors of my demise have been greatly exaggerated. Those of you all who have not heard from me have been lumped in with the same group of people that probably just being nosy. So I stopped sharing information because my life is not a spectator sport. And those of you all who actually support me, support the NFAC, support the liberation of black folks around the world, you know that this is just a hiccup. But when you don't hear something, I begin to see people's true colors. Oh, I've been seeing true colors for several months now. And this is just another exercise. You see a lot of people, they can't function unless someone is providing them the information. And that information has been cut off. You see, if you don't support me, if you don't donate to my legal defense, why do you care what's going on with my case? If you are truly here as a student of the Most High, or if you are here as a supporter of the NFAC, then you can stand around and wait for all of the weak folks to fall off, for the naysayers to get lost. I think it's sad when we can't even show the world that we can stay united because we give in to the same old emotions, the same old demons, the same old apprehensions that we have throughout history. What's really funny to me is that a lot of you all will not lose your fear to replace it with a different type of fear. Can I teach for a second? You see, fear is when you say I'm about it, about it. But when it's time to be about it, you just bout you in the other about it. You find out that you start thinking about your family. You start thinking about what you got. You start thinking about your, your job. You start thinking about your status in the community. You start thinking about what your family members are gonna say. You start thinking about all of that and that stops you from doing anything, except talking about it, except getting an angry face about it, except expressing that you're appalled about it. That's the fear that you have, the fear of what happened to your ancestors, what happened to people that you know in your family, things that, that you don't seen that now that it's your turn, especially anybody that steps into this space, scares you. So you express it in all kinds of ways. You ridicule, you tear down, you attack, because this may force you to confront your fear. The fear that we want to replace that with is a different type of fear. You see the first you gotta understand F-E-A-R, fear. Well, your F is our freedom. We want our freedom. We want our freedom to determine our own destiny. We want our own place. None of that's changed. But when we start to go get it, a lot of y'all got scared because you still got that old fear. Mm -hmm. Because the other letter is E, that's the education. And that's what you were getting. You were getting educated in such a way that you were being elevated in such a way that things were being illuminated to show us the way back to our freedom, our salvation, which is embedded in the education. So understanding where you came from, understanding where you are is gonna help us figure out where we need to go. And that takes us to the last part, the aid. We must arise. Just like they said, arise, O Israel. They didn't say arise just a certain group of Israel. They didn't say arise just to a certain point. They didn't even say arise and walk around and look mad. They didn't say arise and be suicidal. They said arise to your former greatness. They said arise. Last but not least, once you've done the F, the E, and the A, you are now in a position to get to the R, which is the reparations, which is the reparations and restitution, which is the rebuilding, which is the reconstructing, which is the renovation of our minds. It's all of those things, F-E-A-R, lose the fear that was put into you for the last 400 years, lose the self-hate against your own kind that makes you act like we're our own worst enemy and keep proving to everybody that we are. Lose that fear and replace it with F-E-A-R, our freedom, our education, arising to receive our reparations and everything else that's owed to us. I will be back teaching very soon. Stay with me in the straightaway as best you could. Hold on. I may lose some of y'all in the turns because you thought this was over. Oh, no, 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 no. I told you once before, it's just like Moses when he came down from the mountain. Mm -hmm. He came down and saw people doing their own thing. 
people lying almost. People making up stuff about uh, God, not really, you know, telling him what the plan was. Everybody else figured that they could go ahead and do it. Well, it hasn't even been a year yet, and everybody's an expert. Plant a seed, see what grow. So stop running around listening to people who don't know what they're talking about. I'll let you know what I want you to know, if I think you deserve to know it. You're not entitled to anything, especially when you do nothing. But for those of y'all who've been 10 toes down from the beginning, and gonna stay 10 toes down on the end, just stay close, because we about to do our own thing. I bid y'all peace. I bid you shalom. Black Power. Jesus to take you out of slavery I'm from New Orleans, baby I seen a plantation We 